Hello all, welcome to my channel Tech Research. Today's video is related to ChatGPT in which I am going to tell you about pros and cons of ChatGPT. It is highly popular and growing AI tool. There are some benefits and also some disadvantages which I want to discuss in this video. I have created a number of videos on the same like extensions of ChatGPT, how ChatGPT can be used from a data science perspective, from a researcher's perspective. But today I would like to give you a some high level overview of uh, uh, chat GPT like what could be the good and the bad thing of this using this tool as every site has two coins so it would be nice to educate and give you some potential good reasons what are the benefits and disadvantages of using a chat GPT so let's quickly start with the benefits advantages of chat GPT the first thing which I like most is regarding is accessibility and convenience whenever you ask certain query to chat gpt it always comes up easily with the related things so it is very nice easy to use handy tool that is the good thing about chat gpt the second thing is efficiency and time saving so for example if we want to find out a certain query answer to a certain query we used to go to number of websites before introducing chat gpt into our lives and this takes a lot of time consuming process like to go to different websites collect some information and then processes further but chat gpt is reducing first so definitely there is some time savings in with related to use of chat gpt the third interesting thing is personalization with the with the help of chat gpt you can easily create your own personalized you can you can ask the query in your own personal way and there are hundreds of uh, google chrome extensions and different extensions which have been launched in market with the use of this chat gpt so definitely they are all interesting and making a difference in our life so i would say personalization is also a good flavor to add the benefit into the chat GPT tool the next comes which is very unique and I found it very interesting is cultural and language diversity chat GPT supports many different languages and you can get the translation summarization anything text generation of any language using this tool so it is amazing it's not restricted to a specific language there are multiple language support that it provides so it's very nice and it provides good overview around language diversity i would say so it's a very plus point with the use of chat gpt so these are all the different things about the advantages or using benefits of chat gpt but let's speak about the disadvantages or the con side the other negative side of chat gpt the first i would feel is lack of emotional intelligence so many a times it gets repeated or stuck with the queries and it does not give some specific response as we expect so many a times it keeps on repeating generating the same query which makes it like it does not have that human intelligence or emotional intelligence which makes it like more natural the bot is not that matured i would say in this respect of emotional intelligence the second point is potential for misinformation it's not always necessary that the information that has been provided by chat gpt is like accurate authentication of resources we we can just trust and guarantee and just keep on writing or using that stuff we need to cross check so there is a little scope for misinformation i would say with the use of chat gpt third is the ethical considerations so as we know chat gpt is an ai tool so so there are some lack of ethical considerations so there might be a chance that it generates some scripts or words which could be led to some misinformation or hateful speech or disregard information which are not ethically correct up to that so, so this is also a dark side of chat gpt where we have to consider the ethical considerations of all the humans living in a society so i think this is also a point to be considered well and lastly i feel is lack of human connection as i mentioned there is a generated response automated generated response so it does not understand properly how a human would respond to that particular query or to that particular problem so it does not have that flavor it does it it seems to be like a generation of a bot does not generate a response as a human thought process so these are the different things which shows the negative or dark side of chat gpt i hope this is helpful for you to educate yourself what are the good thing and bad thing about chat gpt thank you for watching 
Before leaving, please subscribe to my channel Tech Research for updated notifications. See you in next video. Till then, take care. Goodbye.